Alright, hello everyone. Uh Whoa, a little loud. So I do wanna say Thanks to everyone who's watching my arcade playthroughs. You guys are insane. Most because I can't believe people watch me. Um I'm not gonna to say this often. I don't like doing it. But I will mention, you know. If you do like me, and you like watching, maybe hit subscribe. But, as always, that's up to you. So, on the agenda today, finishing off the trainings, we're starting off with Chaos Realm. Yeah, looking at that Melina playthrough, Get the View of this Gang, is insane to me. Forgot about the mess, the scene guard there. All right, so first person should be in here. There she is. We might have to do her side quest first. No, we do not. I have to read the thing. <laughs> You've located Kira of the Black Dragon Clan. Would you like to train with her? I'm in. That's roughly what it says. Kira. I don't know if I can teach you much. You're too old. Okay. A bit rude, but all right. But if you insist, we can sort of zing. Oh, I'm going to butcher that. Zing yi. Fighting style, which was taught to me when I was young. We'll begin with the basic eye attacks. Yeah. 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 I like the knee. Excellent work. So, yeah, I, I, I hate asking that, but it does feel like. Well, oops. Sorry, <laughs> no. Blow off my game. <laughs> uh, what? Alright. Didn't notice sir. For a second, maybe that moved to work. I'm like, haven't I completed this before, though? My life. Tempo. Let's learn time in Asia, apparently. Here's fun, she has a lot of good combos. Maybe she's next as an arcade playthrough. Who knows? Very nice. 
course, next Friday will be the unlock one. I know I put it off. But, th so the way I'm going to do that is... The first video is going to be... Oops. Is going to be... Be... Is going to be me... What's this? Me unlocking stuff based on my own memory. So that'll be the first video. Um, so everything in that video will be unlocked from what I remember. Um, and then... Since I imagine it'll take two parts anyway. i unlock everything regardless. Um... Then we... The next week... Will consist of me using a guide. So that that's the agenda. Next week will be um that will be the unlock stream, and I'll be doing that first one based off my own memory of the game. And then the next week after that will be using a guide to finish off unlocks. Oops. Okay. Struggling here. Wait, why didn't it have me do the like back wide too? Whatever, I'm not gonna complain. <laughs> Text. This is hard of hearing. I guess because I'm gonna stole jokes from being an old man. Nicely done. By God, not as easy. Nicely done. That was really difficult. Ow, fuck. I wasn't aware of what we were doing. I just completely got kicked in the face. Done. <laughs> just immediate. Just fucking just kick the face. Round one. Fight. <laughs> Bulldog! Austin Bulldog. One of the best moves in the game. I win. Kick up from tits. Hey, alright. So yeah, uh, that's the current plan for next week, um, in terms of Friday. Then... For... Then for, um, Monday... It might be a Kira playthrough since I've kind of interested myself. Um, it could be Kira or Cobra, I think, with the two I'm looking at. What the hell? Oh, it's a coin. <laughs> I thought it was Lee May for a second. Alright, so we need to be heading to Temple of Havoc. We're not training with him. Already done that one. Side quest. So I believe he's in here somewhere. It's temple. Or 
I could be wrong. I've been wrong before. No, I think I saw him. He's over in the area to the left. Wait, what? Who are you? It is a travesty. Normally, the members of the Yanasi and the Yangis are at war. But recently, they have called a truce. Someone should go to their villages in the east and the west and tell lies about each tribe to renew their aggression. Alright, you know what? We might do that. I do not remember that side quest. At all. Um. Okay, well, I can head to the one on the right. But prioritize training. That's what we're doing. Then we'll go back and then we'll. There he is. Hello, Cobra. You've located Cobra, the newest member of the Black Dragon Clan. Do you wish to challenge him? Training. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is a fight challenge, too. If you take a side quest from, uh, I think it's Dairu. All I want is to prove my combo skills. Looks like you'll be my punching bag. I like how... Every other character's training. Don't me. I'm younger than you. Um, it's like actual training. Then you got Cobra, who's just like, nope, fighting. Which kind of makes sense. It fits his character better. Hell, maybe even Kira should have been the way, Midley. Although Kira, as you can look at as she had a side quest, I just didn't have to do it. I always say you had to do her side quest. Um, like everyone else, we're gonna train with. Don't even Tanya, who's one of like Shujinko's listed enemies. Like, it's just normal training. Yes, quite amazing. See, after this, we're going to go over back to the right, to the east, and uh, see if we can't start a war. That's kind of a cool combo. Cool looking kick. I know that it's sold. Look at that. Okay, so... What is it with the Black Dragon having this weird... Combo? Whoops. There we go. I like it has weird registration on its hitting. Like midway through, but not being. Fine. Wait, he doesn't even, what? Oh, A is a low attack, I think. Yeah, there it is. I'm like, where's A? I like the idea of Cobra as a character. They just, I mean, his design may, is his problem. I mean, immediately though, aside from being blonde and a key, and I don't see it. It's not in the right color. It's like, I, 
personally, I don't see the connection to Ryu other than the fact that he's blonde and wearing gi. It's a Ken. It's Ken that they have not Ryu. Like, I, I don't see it. Ken's wearing an entirely different gi. Looks entirely different. Except he's being blonde. He's short hair, that's it. Wearing gi. I, I don't see it. Love that move. Classic. But I like um his uh, story, where he's like he was a vigilante who basically started enjoying right. killing, doled out street justice, and eventually took started taking it too far. That was an interesting premise. Wait, he doesn't tell you. He doesn't tell you how to tell a punch. That's interesting. I never noticed that. He doesn't tell you how to tell a punch. Fox with CH doesn't tell you to spar either. No, he has that, of course. Just sub zero. Round one. It's just sub zero Fight. for mission. I've forgotten the combo. There it is. <laughs> Okay. Love that move. All right. Cobra done. We got three left. I almost said two. Now we got one more in the chaos room. And we're looking at one of them. All right. Goodbye, Cobra. Uh, if I decide to do a side quest playthrough, I do believe I'll kill you. Well, kind of. Alright, but first, we will ignore that chest, because I'll be back here. So now let's... Let's go to this guy's side quest. Because I'm curious about it. So I assume it's the village on the right. So we need to head back to the blue, the light blue one. You know, once I can find the way. You know what? I wonder if F8 has a chest. That little spot looks a bit strange. If it doesn't, well, it looks like it would. Alright, so. Fair to talk to. I assume probably none of these guys. This asshole. Everybody wanders around. Let's play. In case you uh, wonder about that game, everybody wanders around. It's just everyone wanders around. No one wins. There's no rules. Uh, already been misled. This guy looks weird. So, we say you Well, it almost did seem odd. I assume it would be the one guy who speaks normal. Everybody's running around, yes. Don't worry. Thought you talked to Havoc now. May chaos break the boy. Plays the bind. Jesus, that voice. My ears. You. Oh, 
can force serve you. Um, let's try inside. I know one of these has a chest, so we'll still be ignoring that. That's the one that we're ignoring. Although I don't think it matters. I think I have a. Pretty sure that one's Havocs. Ooh, come on. Maybe I have to do it in a specific order. I, I'm unsure. But I feel like that's almost maybe a fair assumption. Alright, well... Wait, was that guy over there before? Okay. Yeah, I don't know who to talk to. Guess we won't do this. That's a shame. I wanted to start a war. Maybe I'll just find another person and maybe we'll come back to this. Since, uh, I might eventually do a slight quest video. Alright, so heading to the light green one. Let's go. Yeah, I do have ideas to still do a side quest one and a maybe a fight challenge one, depending on how I feel about that one. So, so we save. The Yunasi accuse us of siding with the Satan Guard? They will pay. Okay, cool. Do I now have to talk to... On the other side? Yeah, let's go find that guy. Let's see if we can turn in the quest. Get over here. Also, that's a pretty, uh... Weird claim. The two tribes are still at peace. This must not be allowed. Okay, so because of that, let's go find him. Fuck, I don't care. We're playing the side quest. I'm sorry for the side. Side adventure, literally here. We found the other guys, so let's go find the side. Or I'm wrong, he's like near the portal or something. Maybe one of these guys have. Yes, no, yes, no, yes, no. It's somewhat in. Havoc, what about you? you Wanna help me start a war? No. Wait, did people go inside? Sorry. Oh, okay, that's in Baraka. It's not gonna be these guys. Jesus, same line. See? Oh, fine, that worked. Okay, Jesus. Fuck you. Just knock him out. I know I can't talk to him about it. 
Um, what? The Yangis we claim we have sided with the Saden Guard? They will suffer for such a lie. All right, there we go. We start a war. Let's go turn in for that reward. A fun little side quest to do. Go around. Fun little quest to do. Excellent. The two tribes are at war once again. You will find a reward for your efforts in the southwest corner of the maze. Okay. We'll grab that on our way out. <laughs> this guy really gonna make me wander a maze. All right, anyway, on to the next train. Hello, Lee May. Looking good as usual. Please bring her back. And don't make her bullshit NPC. Hey, Rachel. Just, just a dedicated video to, uh... All of Brighter's like fight challenges. I think it has one almost every realm. What the oh, okay. <laughs> that was confusing me. The guy I thought the guy was noob, but I'm like, why is he moving? Evocate noob Saibot and smoke. Tag team combatants, will you join them? Yes, we'll be a trio. Not how that works, but that would be hilarious. Smoke. The pigeon leads to me. Excellent. I'll train you to fight as smoke, and I do. Getting with high attacks from effects style of monkey. <laughs> Bad monkey. This one probably won't be that long anyway. In terms of training, think of that. They don't have a lot of combos. Satisfying attack. Sure is. Not wrong. Just did that one, but alright. Got to I said. <laughs> Don't got a lot of combos. I try to fuck that one up. All right, noob's done. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, that face, face. Love that axe kick. Smoke is really fun. I really like the Mizu. I'm upset. I find Good work. Smoke's second player color, though, so weird. Cause it's like they make him gold except for his shoes and his helmet which i don't understand i feel like it also would have been easy because his second color should be purple like that's that's what he was as a cyborg in mk3 so i really feel like that should have been purple You okay, Smoke? I love when they start off like that super like sped up animation. <laughs> uh, oops. Instinct. Wait, what? That's a longer combo? That's not listed. Alright, that was so far the best thing. Wait, what? Yeah, that's not even listed. That's interesting. Huh. That's not even listed. 
That's kind of cool. What if I'm invisible? If I hear anything, there we go. Oh, I just totally come back. You have passed. Now you don't see me, now you do. Just gonna bundle all these together. It's faster. <laughs> they got lazy. And just said, hey, we'll just we'll just bundle all the smokes together. They'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Noob gets special spots for his two. Oh. I had to do it once, huh? Interesting. I'm already almost done. Let's defeat us both in battle. One. I'm smoke, no. Fight. Catch. Stop it. I don't know why, but I was really hoping, like, he would be still invisible so when he does that. <laughs> it just somehow make, I assume, it break. Alright. So, and that now. Another realm's done. We got two trainings left. But first, we have to stop at that maze to get our reward. Hello, Brightjo. I will say the uh, best thing about front next Friday will be having Lee May unlocked finally. Along with Raiden and people who I don't have. Um, Alright, hold on. So then I can finally do it because I've been kind of really wanting to do a playthrough with them. But I don't have them unlocked. I, I guess I could have unlocked them all my other profiles. But I figure, you know, why why do that? Why ruin the thing? A lot of people like Havoc are already gonna be unlocked when we do that thing. But Is it the southwest corner, right? Maybe in hindsight it should have been southwest corner of the maze. Oh, so maybe that giant eye why did I point at the screen? You can't see my finger. I think it's that giant like Almost peninsula thing at the end there. So let's probably fall this around. That won't work. Alright, so. South. Yeah. West. To here? Nope. So we're not here for an hour. Yeah, see, I think it's over there. Unless this is it. I may have unlocked some accents. I don't think that's my reward. So step into the aging liquid again. Age it to dust. Let's do it. Dead. <laughs> Shit goes dies. It's ages to dust. Um. I mean, unless it's out there. Like, I don't think I can get anywhere southwest. Unfortunately, I don't know how to get out there. 
don't really see any way. It's like, yeah, I I'm guessing that's the reward. Maybe someone uh, post a comment, let me know that hey, you're an idiot. This is clearly a way out. Of which I will say thank you, because we'll be back for that anyway. All right, anyway. Now I'm at 35 minutes, so nothing wrong. Where hopefully it'll be more, I'll have some more interesting conversation. Because where we're going is an area that was very clearly unfinished. Part of it, anyway. The, oh, it's the guy that teleports. You know, Kung Lao, or Dairu, or Smoke, or Noob, I guess, suddenly, or Cobra, or almost any character thinking about it. Jade, Katana. God, how many characters actually have teleports in the series? Tawny game with an MKX. Um, so Melina. Oh, Melina could always teleport. It's not her. I thought for some reason the portal wasn't working. Oh no. How will I leave? A fun little fact is this coin back here isn't obtainable. Like, there's no way to get out there. At least as far as I'm aware. So we, I guess we've glitched out. This is the way to glitch out. Um, I might actually link that. There was a video about hidden secrets about an hour long, I think. But I might link that, because I enjoyed watching that. There's some interesting stuff, like, uh, in the Earthrealm Village, I believe it was, there's a chest and a coin that's hidden at bounds. For some reason. So. Yeah, I'll definitely link that in the description. So, we're not training with Ermac. Record. We are going to train with the last Black Dragon member, Cabal. Also, we're going to get a payment as a guard. You are a guard? I did not <laughs> recognize you. Next time, wear your armor. You have all done well. The zombies have been kept outside the city, and the Oni have been sufficiently intimidated. The mages are pleased. Here is your pay. <laughs> there is no reason to grab that at this point it, other than just sheer like consistency I guess to always grab it come to nether realm talk to them get my pay so wait what hmm I don't remember that one Oh, wait, yeah, I do, because the noob's over here. I'm pretty sure Mr. G... You know what? In the honor of Mr. G Star 3 to 1, I will do this fight. Because he did this fight, and he lost it. And as he said, it is the first time he ever lost that fight. Let's see if I will continue his legacy by losing this fight. Dark combat. I am Ermac. Well... Fight! <laughs> I'm sure this is very exciting gameplay in hindsight. No, I will win. Okay, I won. Even if you can't see it. Round two. two rounds. Wait, what? Fight. Okay, he's just blocking his shit. Stop it. It's kind of weird because like I'm running on audio. This actually is kind of a weird thing to do. Hey, I won. I have avenged Mr. Just Um. Yeah, that's kind of 
it was weird doing the token X slam because I couldn't chug off it. Because I couldn't figure out where he was doing the move because my audio is delayed. Because of working with the recording and everything. Alright, but now on to. That was our side quest, I guess, for Nether Realm. Ball's not this one, he's at. This way, I think. Okay, so, I'll show this here. This area is empty. I'm not even sure if there's a chest in here, I think I'm at. There's no chest, there's no coins. It is a completely empty area. Oh no, there's a chest. Alright, so it's not. So, it probably did last minute. Um. Yeah, aside from that, like, lone chest, maybe some two coin. This area is pretty much entirely barren. Um, there's even a fight. Like, nothing spawns in here past the coins and chests. Uh, there is at the bridge at the top here. For, I think that's the one we need to go to anyway for Cabal. Oh. Okay, well, it dead ends. Um, at that bridge at the top, there's a fight challenge with Molina. What the hell? That was Dyro. Oh, I didn't know he spawned here. Well, shit. I'm wrong. Oh, you know what? I am wrong. It's the area up top that's barren. has nothing in it. Because, uh, and I think that area was just unfinished. Because... Up there at that bridge is a fight challenge with Melina. And... What the fuck? That's kind of cool. Um, when you lose... Here, I'll, I'll show you, actually. So we're not going to So... Most fight challenges have... Um, a fail text. Uh, for just one of the ones we'll probably end up seeing in the unlock video will just be fatality. So, defeat Melina for Ubly today. Round How did I get Melina? Fight. That annoys me. I can actually win easily. I'm gonna let her kill me so I can show you the case, though. Then we'll avenge that after because I actually do come up with Melina. Um, so most fight challenges have a, a specific fail text for them. That was just unnecessary. However, this one does not. It just repeats the, the intro text. Just defeat me if you need that. Combined with the area behind it having no... Um, God, this must be very easy to watch. Get this. I win. <laughs> Fuck you. Um, but yeah, the entire area behind it is is barren and doesn't have any chests. Uh, maybe we'll explore it later, just for the hell of it. But yeah, this area over here. If there's anything, there, again, like I said, there might be coins or chests, but as far as I'm aware, I don't think there's that cheating here. Yeah, see, it's totally empty. Nothing spawns. There's this, like, thing here. Little structure. And then I think there's a... Some form of building over here. No, okay, it's just another structure. But yeah, it's, it's not finished. It's a shame. Um, I've always wanted, like, if we could get a, a full remake of the game. Right, look at Cabal, founder of the new Black Dragon. We join him. Um, I've always wanted to say I would like a remake of the game and I want them to finish it. Finish what they originally were doing. So areas like that. I mean, I know that'd probably be difficult. Come on. See, so you want to join the ranks of the new Black Dragon. Your trials will be difficult. I will not accept weakness. Trying to begin with some days. So, yeah. Um, I really would like them if they ever remake this game to finish it. There's a lot of side quests and stuff that aren't finished. 
a lot of items that aren't used. Um, maybe, you know, it's a too late situation, obviously. Which I wouldn't blame him. A remaster alone would just be nice. Wait, what? Okay, wait, on to... Wait, what? Fuck. What am I doing? <laughs> wait, I want to restart. I'm confused. Am I doing... Why am I on Gojo Ryu? Gojo Ryu, whatever. Oh, wait. Trainings don't work like that. <laughs> or punch them in the face for no reason. But yeah, I, I kind of want to see what they do with that area. There's a bunch of unfinished stuff in the game, and that's the one that stands out to me most. Come on. Um, even like. Yeah, I'm doing like power attacks still. For some reason, like. I lost it. I'll get back to it. Yeah, it's straight on the go Fuck low attacks. You know, maybe there's something else that looks strange. In that, it, I'm feeling like Cabal's training wasn't finished. Um, but I always thought it was weird that Cabal was in Nether Realm. Okay, so wait. Does Sunbin not have low attacks? No, it does. Of course it does. Um, I was so weird that Cabal was in the Nether Realm. I feel like he, uh, he's where he should be where New Smoke is. This is the weirdest training I've ever done. What the fuck? Make any sense? Fuck some bin high attacks. Who gives a shit? Just go to right basic combos. What the fuck? I've never noticed this before. It's so strange. I hope it loops back around to it. Just like no one like doesn't even let like, you know, it just loops back around to some bin low attacks. Why did it Nope, straight to hook swords. Just uh fuck Sunbin, I guess. No one gives a shit about that. I'm not sure. Whoa, what the fuck? That was a really fast animation. I, I don't remember that. <laughs> yeah. Cabal, you forgot your primary low attacks, though. And combos, for that matter. But okay. Wonder what the advanced combo's gonna be. Okay, they're actually combos at least. Okay, at least those were actually the combos. Oh, and yeah, okay, wait, I lied. These were the advanced combos. I don't know why, but as soon as I thought like, it inverted the Y and X. On the second one. What? That's so strange that it doesn't have some been low attacks. As far as it even has that one, honestly. It went straight from like, high attacks into the power of pop up. You have done and then just went straight out to that. I like that. Uh, it's the only character that has a, a style branching from his weapon. It makes him kind of fun to play. There's a lot of other characters. You but have passed. It's so weird. I did. Clearly, I guess it was unfinished. I don't even know like if that's being unfinished. So that's just strange. The high attacks are just bundled with power attacks. Oh, I love this move. 
Once I can do it. Is a a shame that Kapal does not have this move anymore. No matter touch, I love the move. No low attacks, don't worry about it. They don't exist. Raging Flash. You have done well. It's weird, because I think we called it was that MK9 the first called it Nomad's Dash. Just better. Round one. Fight! Ha! He doesn't understand. <laughs> like, what the hell is this? I haven't taught you this move. Look at this. <laughs> he doesn't actually know. If this were okay, I was gonna say I could just win. I'm still going for it. Low attack only. Let's go. He's learned how to fight it, but like, all right, there we go. The light kick. The fact that I can do those high attack, low attack, so high attack, great. Get teach me high attacks. All right. Anyway, <sighs> Delve another realm. I did. That was the strangest training I've ever done in my life. You know, that might just be one of the strangest things I've ever done. In Deception. I've never realized how busted that is. That's kind of funny, though. Yeah. Seriously, uh, remaster the game. Come on, Netherrealm. What are you doing anyway? Not doing MK11, that's for sure. I was gonna say if the guards are there and then click my pay again. I, like, I'm actually gonna laugh. That'd be really funny. Don't worry, we'll collect our pay next time. Right now, we train with the last person. Earthrealm's mightiest hero and champion of Mortal Kombat, Liu Kang, is dead. But, you know, I, lo I love Raiden's old voice. The, I, I will say, MK, uh, the first MK movie, Crystal Lambert, is awesome. I do enjoy him. But nothing will get... To, to me, Raiden has always been best when he has his voice. We'll do this as a side quest, because... I don't seem to have to do this fight anyway. To you, between you and like other society, it's Jax. Good job, Jax. We'll do this for the hell of it. Why not? I feel like we could do some form of side quest here. Okay. Well, this seems a bit unfair. Shit, if he blocks them, I'm screwed. I win. Does this count? No. I will say my uh, favorite for this fight is Kenshi. Because he has the judo fighting style, which has two throws in it. In addition to all his throw moves. It's kind of weird. Some's like you get like uh, go over there. You get like um, an opportunity to deal actual damage. Round two. Um, I know Mr. Star 321 thought it had something to do with juggling. Maybe he's right. I think honestly, what it is though. Is I think the game just doesn't understand that throws only is meant to be the thing still. Once you deal damage. Shit. Maybe here, let's see. Yeah, see, it's not working there, so there's no new juggles. Too far away. 
That didn't even look like he blocked it. It looked like, or it looked like he blocked it with a punch. Shit. Get over there. Throw. Stop it. I do find it interesting that, uh, how complete Jax's moveset is. Like, he is the only one in the game, like, he has his actual weapons, and he has his uh, primary fighting style from Dead Alliance. Like, because he has Muay Thai, and he has Judo, so he has all of his fighting styles. And there's the Tonfa. Granted, the Tonfa just require a model, but considering, um... I mean, same with Quan Chi, I guess, but... I don't know, that's a bit strange. Though. That kind of looks weird, actually. Lava. You have located Liu Kang, champion in Mortal Kombat. Will you train with him? Yes. Yes, I will. Shijinko, I know you've been deceived by the Dragon King, do not spare, though I'm both spirit, I will teach you what I can to aid you in your mission. Begin with the Junfin high attacks. You know, I'm gonna be honest, I bet he'll actually teach us low attacks. Let's see. You have passed. Low attacks. The sprite should have taught me these in the years ago. I should just him if I'm gonna like say it, right? <laughs> These are the power of pop attacks with Jump Fan. I learned these from the White Lotus. Science of King. I do like uh, the Zombie Luke Kang here. Looks a lot better than the fucking Revenants, too. Okay. I can't say that. I feel like the zombie Liu Kang better. Almost as good as me. I feel like it would just um, the whole case of Revenant. The Revenant story in general was could have been interesting. Well done. But they just didn't do much with it. What is with the spacing on the bottom? The hell? It looks so strange. Have that? I just don't notice it. Maybe they all do. Hmm. Wow, I don't think I deserve that combo. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. That did not occur. Next! Pycho advanced combos. <laughs> he didn't know what to say. You have passed. I could be wrong. Um, I do find it strange Luke King uses nunchucks. Sorry, nunchaku. Because if I remember correctly, I could be wrong. But I remember Nunchaku are pretty much a Japanese weapon. So I don't know, to me, him using them is a bit strange. But I'm not saying it's impossible for him to use one. I don't know, it's just a bit weird to me. Um, I will say I do appreciate him getting back. But also, um, at the same time, I know most people's a huge complaint of the 3D era was it tried to give everyone a weapon. Which is exactly what they've done in MK11. Uh, Hell, Liu Kang got his nunchucks back. 
Um, Sindelgar going down back, which is a weird one to me because everyone I saw who bitched about that weapon was that it didn't fit Sindel. Which I agree with. I actually agree. I don't think it looks good on her. Um, I remember so when Tanya got a Naganada in MKX. I thought it was so weird. Um, but I think they pulled it off well. I think the way she uses it is so strange that it kind of works. Almost as good as me. So I think Tanya getting Naganada kind of worked out. Even though I don't like her fucking tiny ass tampas. Like, I don't like the really tiny Kobujutsus, they just look ridiculous. Which might be opposite. You were learning quickly, but you still have one left to master this kick. Master Raichu taught me to use against Shang Tsung. It was with this kick, I defeated the source many years ago. Hey, he's actually right. Um, yeah, so in MK2, the uh, intro shows. Whoa. Liu Kang, calm down. Um, in the intro, I'm gonna do a pop up so I can actually do the move. Um, in the intro to MK2, they actually show Liu Kang defeating Shang Tsung. And he uses that flying kick. I love how little that hits. Calm down. Excellent. Wait, no flying? All right. That's a shame. I was kind of enjoying that. Was flying kick. Nope. I'll tell you much, Jinko. For your final test, you must fight me. Round one. Fight. Go. I forgot the combo. Ooh, what the fuck? I defeated you, just like you defeated Shang Tsung. Alright, um, so I will... For an hour or two minutes. I don't know why, I just tricked myself and think I wasn't recording. That would have been a fucking shame. Alright, so, um... That's where we'll leave it. And I will see you guys on Monday for that video when I upload that. Of course. So, uh, thanks for watching. Seriously, th thanks for watching. And, uh, goodbye.